briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1983, the United States Court of Appeals for the 11th Circuit heard the case Graphic Products Distributors, Inc. v. iTech Corp., which focused on the unreasonable territorial restrictions placed on product distribution by companies without valid business justifications. The case followed a framework established by the Supreme Court to determine if such restrictions were anti-competitive. iTech Corporation, a manufacturer of graphic equipment and supplies, was found guilty of implementing anti-competitive practices by placing unreasonable restraints on the trade territory of graphic products distributors, GPD. In 1975 to 76, iTech switched to a dual distribution system to increase sales outside major urban centers, leading to the lawsuit. The court ruled that these restraints negatively impacted GPD and had no valid business justification, resulting in injury to GPD. GPD was awarded approximately $200,000 in damages for lost future profits. ITEC argued that the evidence was insufficient to establish liability and damages and that the jury instructions misstated the applicable law. However, despite some reluctance due to the limited evidentiary record, the court affirmed the verdict. The district court's decision to deny ETEC's motion for judgment NOV on liability was also upheld. Ultimately, the court's decision in this case reinforced the idea that companies cannot place unreasonable territorial restrictions on the distribution of their products without valid business justifications, highlighting the importance of fair competition and consumer welfare. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.